Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and I've turned up the volume at Fisherman's Horizon, and let's play Final Fantasy VIII! Let's check this place out. I think my cats are trying to assassinate me. Can cats assassinate people? Can I be assassinated? I mean, I'm not a political figure, but... Eh. Well, they got a giant... What is that thing? Looks like a satellite dish, I think. I don't know. Well, we just discovered the place. Besides, how old is the place? Like, what, ten years old, Sid was saying? Or that's when they got Bound Garden, or something like that. Well, I guess you guys are better at your maintenance than we are. Hey, you got all this rust everywhere. What the hell? Doesn't look like good maintenance to me. Let's see. But I do know that we have a secret ladder here. Yeah, they hid that one pretty good. Nice to know they still have their secret passages. Just like, you know, in a good old NES game. Great job, guys. But yeah, yeah. Remember that fisherman guy that we nearly killed earlier? He's over this way. I don't know how you're supposed to figure this one out on your own. Come to think of it, I don't know how I figured it out on my own. I don't think I've read, read it in a walkthrough or anything like that. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I guess this guy doesn't like to listen to the music. So he goes all the way out here. Sorry, dude. Uh, we couldn't avoid it. Sorry, officer. You're going too fast, and I didn't know how to put the brakes on it. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, we, we heard you the first time. Well, he seems like he knows what he's doing, but uh, can't seem to hold on to a minnow. Or, well, I just contradicted myself there. Whatever. Anyway, if you talk to him and you say, hey, I'm sorry, dude, we get a cult fan free. I was about to say a cult fan free, but, oh, well, yeah, I suppose it is a free a cult fan version number three or issue number three, whatever. Uh, sure, why not? The least I could do. Oh, here's a friend over there at the docks. Goon docks? No, no, just ordinary docks. Sure, why not? We'll head on over there. I forget what we get for doing that. If you remember, let me know, viewers. I don't think it's like anything major. I think it's like an item or something. Something not very important. But I'll do the little side quest anyway, because it's amusing. Uh, so anyway, here's number three, Summoning Legend. Ooh. 666 items. Whoa, that's a lot of them. So let's see, in the first two... What were they saying that we needed? We needed steel pipes. What was the other one? Something with Marlboro, so we need Marlboro tentacles. And there's one more item that we need, but we don't know what it is. We'll have to get the Cult Fan 4 to figure that one out. I think. However that works. Ah, uh, you smell that atmosphere, viewers? That is the smell of freedom. And it smells like fish and rust. Hey, these guys, what do they need all this technology for if they're just a bunch of fishermen? I mean, I love the atmosphere here and everything. Man, I even turned up the volume on this music and it still doesn't seem like it's loud enough. Eh, whatever. If you really want to hear it, well, play the game. Uh, sure. So, it said... On the dialogue box there, it said, Face going down. In that order. Esthar? Oh yeah, those were those guys that we were fighting against in uh, Laguna's dream there. Oh. Uh, really? Huh. Well, I'll keep that in mind. We can't get over there right now. Uh, yeah, peed our pants, you know, what can I do? I couldn't step on the brakes. No. No. You know, for people who say that they keep track of it, 
or keep on top of their machinery pretty well. They sure don't, uh, they sure take forever to, uh, get an elevator ride going. Okay, um, okay, let's talk to this guy. Why not? Uh, what do you mean? I just got here. Oh. oh okay, fair enough. How did you get up there so, or back down here so fast? Sorry, dude. Ah, well, there you go. I operate my LPs with my brother someday. We're thinking about Psyched in Setsu 3 now. I'm actually playing it right now to get it ready, but I don't know when I'll do it, so I haven't like made an announcement or anything, but just so you guys know, we are thinking about it, so. Yeah, we kill people. Sure! What's wrong with that? Oh, okay, I won't kill any of you. Oh, I guess so. Well, let's see, what did Sid want us to do? Talk to the elder or mayor? Okay, been playing too much Terranigma lately. Not that there is such a thing, but if there were, I am. Whoa! Yeah, my emulator freaks out at this spot, too. I think that's the last time my emulator freaks out in this game for some reason. Oh well, it's not that annoying, and it doesn't seem to show up on the final recording, either. My screen just flashes real fast. Hey, how's it going? Oh, hey, it's the guy who was in charge of Galbadia Garden. Oh, well, you went to Timber, or... Oh, guns? Oh, you mean literally open arms. Remember earlier in the game when I lost the Ifrit card to General Caraway in order to get him to play Renault's card? Well, if you talk to him again, he'll say that he lost the Ifrit card already to Martine. So let's see if I can, I can get him to play that. There it is. Got it. Okay. Uh-oh. He's a crafty player. He's taking his time, cons carefully considering his moves, even though a computer can calculate its moves in nanoseconds, but... Well, depending on the computer. Uh, let's see. No, I don't want to steal it back right away. Ooh, and we got a water symbol, which will work well for my, uh... What's that card? My, uh... My Leviathan card. Unless he puts something there first. Oh, come on. Hurry up. Make your move. There we go. Uh, I can't get that back. Let's take this one. See, we got the elemental rule, so that boosts the numbers on Leviathan by one. So there we are. Uh... Now I gotta think about this a little bit. I can't put that there because that'll lower my stats by one. Um, hmm. This is a pickle. Yeah, we'll use that one. There we go. Okay, now I just gotta make sure that he doesn't take a card back. Can I do anything? No, he'll still get me. If I do that, I should be fine. Now the other rule that they have here is called Sudden Death. The way it works, and it's nothing to really worry about, but what can happen is if you have a draw in a game, you'll, your cards will automatically be redistributed between the two of you based on the direct rule, and then you'll play another game immediately after that. Now, if you win, you'll get all your cards back, obviously, and then you can select whatever cards you want to win normally. Now, I could talk to the mayor there at this point in time, but that'll trigger the next sequence of events, so I don't want to do that quite yet. Let's head over here instead. I guess over here it's okay to walk on the railroad tracks. I don't even care about... I don't care about most draw points in the game, except on certain islands, but besides that... And your name is Drunkard. Yeah, that's great. Hey, how's it going, babe? Oh, sorry. I just like talking to random strangers for some reason. This is going to be some more Triple Triad that we can play here later. But, uh, well, not right now. Not right now. Soon enough, viewers. Let's see. Yes, here we are. You don't even have to stay at the hotel here. They pay you at this hotel. No. Nah, no. Nah. But we do get Timber Maniacs number seven or eight or seven. There we are. Okay. I don't think the people here... No, no, we don't have anything to say here. I don't know why they just suddenly, you know, leave single file. Stay single file! 
There we go. And there's an item shop there, if you care. I'm not gonna buy too many items in this game until I'm ready to get like 60 of them, but you know what I'm talking about. Huh? Evolve? What do you mean by that? We'll learn more about that later. Oh, into what? Do I wanna know? No, no, I guess not. Okay, well, we'll be going to uh, the village there uh, eventually, viewers. Now, if you go over here, the music stops. There's the Master Fisherman's Pupil, and here's the Junk Shop. So, what I want to do is I want to upgrade some of my weapons, particularly Squall, to the Flame Saber, and then I'll talk to the Fish Master Fisherman's Pupil here. Next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.